Good morning. <laughs> Good morning. It is a fabulous Wednesday morning. And here I am, Angel, with Courageous Coffee Talk. Um, I'm going to go ahead and share a little bit of who I am. My name is Angel Gobel. I am a proud mama. I have an amazing husband. And I am a leader of the Higher View Nation of Women. I am leading women to know their identity, their true identity, and to walk it out in life. Um, so, and I always like to share my cup of the day. It's Wonder Woman, woohoo! Um, so, and I, I've been having fun with this. I did it yesterday, so I'm gonna continue to do it. A little fun fact about me. And I'll be sharing a fun fact every day. In the comments below, share a fun fact about you so I can get to know you. The whole reason that I am doing this Courageous Coffee Talk, for one, is to build connections, and two, to build relationships, and to come on and encourage you, to encourage you somewhere in your life for the day. So, um, but Wonder Woman, um, hi Nina, nice to meet you. Um, I, so Wonder Woman, you know, a lot of people, she's been around for a long time. <laughs> she's a DC, uh, a character and whatnot. But when me and my husband got together, he was shocked by all that I was doing and, and whatnot. I was a single mom at the time and we became a blended family and, um, I just all the things going on. And he's like, wow, he goes, you're like Wonder Woman. And it always kind of just stuck. Um, and, you know, just funny things like that. But I will tell you, the Wonder Woman movies that have recently came out, you know, the last, I think, eight years, um, six years, um, have been very inspiring um, to stand in courage and to push through in areas. And it just, it really speaks to me. <laughs> So I absolutely love Wonder Woman and the background of what it stands for. Um, you can touch your nose with your tongue. That's awesome. I love that. I cannot do that. Um, so that's really cool. Um, one thing, so I'll sh uh, share another little fun fact. So my husband called me Wonder Woman since we've been together. So that's kind of his little fun name for me. But I am double jointed in my wrist. I think that's what you call it. And I can literally put my hand down and spin and twirl my wrist all around. Um, it's been years since I've done that. So that's kind of a little fun fact right there with a little bit about yours. Um, so today I want to just share with you, um, give you some courage today in the sense of something I was kind of pondering and sitting here talking um, to the father about a little bit um, before I got on was there's a total difference between motivation and courage. Like completely two different things. So I'm not coming on here to motivate you. Motivation is a desire and reason. So I have a desire and reason, yes. But I'm not giving you that motivation. Because motivation, I feel like it comes and goes. As soon as you're done listening to the person speaking, you got pumped up, and then it goes away. Courage. Your courage is your ability and willingness to act. So today I called your courage is your ability to be willing to act. So ability and willingness to act. So when you sit here and you listen to somebody like me, or you go and have motivation spoken over you, um, it is your job to have the courage now because you have the ability, you just have to have the willingness to act. And I was like, that makes complete sense. And one thing, um, so I sat down and really wanted to have my word for the year or just the, you know, just have inspiration for the year. Um, and the Lord gave me my word and, and um, between him and me and, 
And one of my words is courage, courageousness. And um, my husband, he got inspiration. And I started taking the two together because the Lord's really working on me and my husband coming together. Um, we're together all the time. And we do things together. And we run a business together. And all of these things. But really coming together in all areas. Um, which I already thought we were. <laughs> But we're finding out little areas where I'm needing to stretch and he's needing to stretch. So we can come together more smoothly and work together as a team because we are a lot stronger together as a team. And um, so I just thought it was really cool when the father's like, yeah, inspiration is his word, encourage is my word. And I'm wanting to come on and inspire you in courage to give you, you know, the tools that you need to be able to grab courage with the ability and the tools and you to take your willingness to walk it out. And I just thought it was funny and he's needing courage to get on and do live videos and um, to do more writing and things like that. So it was like really cool that the father gave us our words and they work so perfectly and beautifully together I just think it's so sorry I have uh, music on in the background and my YouTube is deciding to anyways but um, so inspiration inspiration to go out there and know that you have the courage in you you just have to be willing to act upon it. Um, so I just loved that. Just really, really good. Um, and so earlier I shared fun facts about myself. Someone shared a fun fact about them. Put a fun fact in here about yourself. Um, it's fun. And um, so I always love saying this. You know, we've got so much on our plates. We had lots that we probably didn't accomplish yesterday because our list was like this long. We have lots that we need to do tomorrow. But the main focus is doing our best today. Use what is in your hands today. Use the tools that you have today. Don't worry about tomorrow. Don't worry about what didn't happen yesterday. Use your tools in your hands today. And I always tell you, Sit down, pause, take a moment, and journal. Spend time, put your thoughts on paper. I always say pen to paper. Pen to paper will make things happen. It will inspire you. You will have vision in front of you. Um, it's so important to have your vision in front of you. So, um, yeah, I'm going to leave you with that today. Thank you so much for coming and joining me this early morning on Courageous Coffee Talk. Um, have fun back. Share some comments in the feed. And um, I always love to speak um, an affirmation over you. You are brave. You are bold. You are beautiful. And you are loved. Go out today and do something courageous. All right. Love you guys. Bye.